this segment brought to you by EY, empowering today's leaders to realize tomorrow's opportunities. Now, the role of business plays today is a completely different landscape than what it was just two years ago. That's as companies are taking strides to invest in their people, both professionally and personally, and also evolve in ways supporting their changing needs as well. So joining me now is Ginny Carlier, EY America's Vice Chair of Talent. Uh, Ginny, such a pleasure to have you here. Thanks so much for joining us. The pandemic clearly has changed the labor market as we know it, and so many organizations have evolved to support their people. So how is EY navigating this environment here? Uh, thanks, Baker, and glad to be here. You know, no doubt, you know, we're in the great resignation and, and no organization is immune to that. But, you know, I, I like to think of it as we're also in a great opportunity to really recreate the way we're working to support our people. And you know, we, we often say it, the world today is so different than it was almost two years ago. The pandemic really changed, you know, really the, our personal and our professional, professional lives, and it's vastly changed the role of the employer. People and employees want to feel supported. They want to feel supported both inside and outside the work. They want to be a part of an organization that supports their evolving needs. And they want to know their organization cares about their growth. And so at EY, we've implement, implemented EY way of working. And really what it's done, Baker, is it's, it's really harnessed the best of, of who we were uh, before the pandemic and really taken those experiences and those benefits that we achieved during the last two years and, and bringing those together. Um, the, and our true objective in all this is really to provide what we call flexible or predictable flexibility. And that means, you know, being, you know, being flexible in where we work, how we work, and, and really also delivering those in-person interactions that really make our job so special. All right, so you mentioned EY's way of working here. Break that down for us just a little bit more about sort of how that works. What, Jenny, are sort of the big takeaways you guys have learned from it? Yeah, you know, there's, there's, there's really three key factors that we took away, and I, and I like to affectionately call it EY Wow. Um, you know, it's the three factors are really well-being, learning and development, and inclusion and belonging. And you know, with well-being, we're really focused on our people's um, holistic well-being. You know, and what it means to support a person emotionally, physically, financially, and also socially. Um, with learning and development, you know, we're working to ensure that we're providing our people this apprenticeship and mentorship and really those growth and skill building opportunities that are so important. Um, and then those development opportunities that you know really help our people build on those skills and really accelerate their careers. And then inclusion and belonging. I mean, this is so important um, to really fostering that diverse and that inclusive work environment that you know, really allow our people to feel supported, really feel safe, um, no matter where they're working, whether they're working at home, whether they're working in an EY office or at a client location. Okay, so let's talk about some of the other ways, EY, that you guys are investing a lot in your employees. What are you guys really doing here? Uh, that's a great question. I, you know, I think what we've learned over the last few years and what has evolved is that organizations really need to focus on the totality of their rewards. Um, it used to be very much uh, centered on compensation and bo bonus programs, and, and competitive pay is still incredibly important. But really, it's also about the benefits that you offer your peop people, the development opportunities, and the recognition programs. Um, it's really key to differentiating in today's environment. Um, you know, at EY, I, you know, as a professional services firm, you know, people are foundation to our business. And so ensuring that they feel supported is, is absolutely paramount to our success. And so if you look over the last two years, you know, we've incrementally invested $2 billion in total rewards for our people. And of course, that's increases in compensation and bonuses, but that's also um, you know, investments in our recognition programs and our well-being benefits. And you know, I just want to highlight the importance of well-being benefits. And you know, if we look at some of the things that we've changed over the last two years, we've increased the number of no-cost counseling and mental health coaching sessions that are not only available to our people, but also to members of their household. And we've increased that from five to 25 sessions a year. We've also expanded our well-being fund and enhanced it because what we've realized over the last two years is, is that depending on the workforce and where you're at in your career, things are different and what you need in your well-being. And so we've enhanced things like you know, vacation lodging and travel, gym memberships, meal delivery services with people working at home more often, um, mattresses, given how important sleep is, um, and gaming consoles um, for our younger generation. And then we also launched, you know, in connection to EY way of working, we launched a transition fund. And 
And why this was so important is we wanted to support our people in safely getting back together in really these purposeful ways. Um, and we wanted to help reimburse them for the out-of-pocket expenses to make that happen around team building activities, commuting costs, dependent and, and even pet care. Um, so these are some of the ways that we've been investing differently in our employees' benefits. Uh, really great stuff. Uh, Ginny, such a pleasure to meet you. Ginny Carleris, EY America's Vice Chair of Talent, joining us this morning. And the segment was brought to you by EY, helping you realize your transformation through the power of people, technology, and innovation. For more, visit ey.com.